Hello all, welcome to SourceCAD tutorial and you must be surprised by looking at the window right now we are having quite a lot of circles scrambled out here with polylines, arcs and many different things so you must be wondering what I am up to actually in this tutorial we are going to look at one of the features which is built to AutoCAD but is rarely used that is counting number of entities Suppose you have a drawing something like this which you are finding on your screen right now with lots of circles, arcs and many things. You don't know the dimension of each of the object and yet you want to count the number of objects. For example, you want to know how many red circles are here or how many green circles are here. So manually it won't be possible or if it is possible it will take quite a lot of time. So there is a built in tool into AutoCAD that you can use and it might come in handy in these cases. So I'll tell you how you can do this. Depending upon certain criteria, you can make the selections and count number of objects. Let's begin this. For that, I'll draw your attention towards this utility panel of Home Ribbon. On this, here you will find a quick select tool. So go to this quick select tool. This window will pop up. Here on this window, the first option is apply to. That means you want to make a selection from which part of the drawing. Keep it at entire drawing. So we are going to apply your selection to complete drawing so keep it entire drawing now the object type click here and here you will find different type of objects this window will be populated depending upon the objects which you have drawn on the screen for example if you have a polyline polyline will appear if not it won't come to this place if you have a circle on screen this will appear here so depending upon the number of objects that are on the screen this window will be populated for example right now in this case we want to select this circle we want to count number of circles so I'll select circle here now for a circle we have all the properties listed here and the properties are color layer line type radius diameter circumference and all these properties you can select any of the property to make the selection for example let's go ahead and select all the circles with a radius of 2.5 units that means we want to select all the circles with radius exactly equal to 2.5 so go to radius and in operator you have got many operators here but right now we are concerned about equal operator so go to equals and type a value of 2.5 and click ok as soon as you do this all the circles with radius equal to 2.5 will be selected and now if you want to know number of objects you can find it on this command line here so what were the number of objects expand it a little and there it is 51 items selected so the number of objects were 51 although you don't need to expand it this much just keep it this much this will help okay now let's go to another selection suppose we want to select all the red circles we want to know the count of all red circles go to this again entire drawing and in object type go to circle this time I'll go to color and equals red so after all the parameters are set click ok and all the circles which are red they are selected and number of objects here you can find it is 20 so we have 20 red circles on the screen ok so what about other selections like arc and polygon you can find this arc clearly here but you don't know how many arcs are there in this drawing so let's select the arc now go to this tool again entire drawing go to arc and this time you want to select all the arcs you don't want to specify any special character any specific property just you want to select all the arcs for that what you will do okay you can select any of the parameters for that because any of the parameter can define it so I'll select a parameter like radius and here I'll select an operator greater than so and in value I'll write 0 so all the arcs with radius greater than 0 will be selected and obviously any arc which is on the screen will be of radius greater than 0 so click OK and here we have four items selected so we have four arcs on the screen so this is how you're going to make the selections specific selections and also you can use this tool to count number of objects on screen so I hope you understood this this will help and if you have any doubt just let me know in the comments thank you for watching once again 
Have a nice day.